Supercar Blondie. Whoa. Wait, that sounds futuristic. Wait, finish line. No. No. Outstanding Oh my, that was violent. That was violent. Does this have F1 tires? Looks like it has F1 tires as well. Alright, welcome back. Back here once again on the Crew Motor Fest, and today it is Dream Cars presented by Supercar Blondie. So let me do this. And I have to buy something. Wait a damn. One million dollars. I have to spend one million. Well, there goes my money. Uh, what color? Stock color, this one. Rims. That one. One million! That's a lot of money. That's actually a lot of money. Is this car good at least? Sounds good. Hopefully it was worth the money. I guess I'll find out later. Let me go to this first event. Here we go. Let's see this intro. Supercar Blondie, I'm here to make you discover the rarest and most inconceivable cars on this planet. We're talking getting up close and personal. I'm joining the Motorfest adventure with one goal in mind. Gather the best concept cars ever made and put you in the driver's seat. Check this out, guys. Ready? For the first time, we are unleashing these dream cars and putting them to the test. And it's up to you to unlock their full potential. After all, this is no regular motor show. This is Motorfest. The future awaits. Are you ready? I am ready. Dream cars presented by Super Car Blondie. Alright, I'm testing this car out right now. And I'm already crashing. That's great. Whoa, now. First person looks amazing. Look at this looks futuristic. This looks different. I've never seen this before. Speed, um, pretty fast, pretty fast. I don't know how fast, but it's fast. So that's, that's nice. Oh, this is fast, actually. What's up, guys? It's Supercar Blondie here in Hawaii at Motorfest, and I'm ready to introduce our very first two supercars. I reckon if we're gonna do this, we gotta start big. Ooh. Our first theme, concept cars, a Lamborghini. Right, you can choose between the very rarely seen Lamborghini Egoista or okay. the, I cannot believe this is real, Terzo Millennium. I have to go down. And just feel what it's like to set them free in this world. You think you're ready? I have to choose Let's the left go. one. I already own the right one. Well, I already own the left one. I have to choose this one. Lamborghini Terzo. The GTA car. Terzo Millennium. The most futuristic Lambo ever made. And let's be honest, you can never go wrong with a Lamborghini. Whoa. Wait, that sounds futuristic. You guys hear that? No gears? No gears. Just one gear. This thing sounds... It looks future. Yep. Look at that. First person looks futuristic as well. This thing's actually sick. Sounds cool for an electric car. I'll make it, right? Uh, I'll make it, right? Oh, no. Okay, I'm right here. I'm good. Come on. There's no way. There's no way. Okay, I'm right here. That's good. Alright, I made it. There you go, guys. The Lamborghini Terzo Millennio, like you've never seen it before. That is right. I have never actually seen it before. Alright. I outrun the clock. Next one. Win the race. Wait, what? Oh, let me choose this one again. Because I already own the other one. Lamborghini Terzo Millennio. I'm on it. Good choice. All right, that Lamborghini Terzo Millennio is ready to race. Are you? I sure am. The best word to describe this car is visionary. Let me tell you about it. It was developed in collaboration with MIT. It's a look to the future of Lamborghini. It's all electric with a super capacitor. And get this, the body of the car is made from special materials that generates its own electricity. What? That's the future. And I almost forgot, it's going to have a special sonic signature to replace the roar of the V12 engine that Lamborghini is so well known for. The Terzo Millennio. Get ready to step into the future. 
And there's that sound again. Should be able to hear it. That futuristic sound. I got this in the bag. Look at that. Oh my. I didn't realize how good the acceleration was. Jeez. I let go. Then I hit the gas. Just look. Hear it. Sounds good. I'm losing now. Wait, what's happening here? I'm losing. Oh, I'm not using boost. I didn't even use boost the last time. Yeah. Maybe I raise the difficulty up by one again? Before now? Because I am gone. I'm gonna raise it up by one. See what happens. Oh, just like that, finish line. Oh, it's a party at the end too. Look at all the lights. Here we go. All right, uh, I'm gonna change it to four out of five now. Difficulty four out of five. There we go. Out run the clock again. All right, what car is it gonna be this time? What's up, guys? The show continues, and we're not slowing down. Another dream Ooh. manufacturer has lent us two Bugattis? unbelievable concept cars. Elegant, impressive, and elusive. We're talking about the Bugatti Veyron Barchetta and the one and only Bugatti La Voiture Noire. Which car are you going to pick? One of the toughest decisions for sure. This is Dream Cars Part 2. Choose, drive, and make us fly. Kind of look the same. Kind of look the same. I'm not going to lie. Uh, I'm going to choose this one, though. The rare one. The one of a kind. The Bugatti La Voiture Noire. Let me tell you more about this incredible car. <laughs> Looks uh nice. We got gears now. All right. Now I gotta shift again. Interior check. How does the interior look? Oh, it looks like a Bugatti interior. Okay. All right. This uh, might be challenging. I'm barely making these checkpoints by like 15 seconds. Oh wow. Wait, what? Alright, that was kind of close. Alright, this is actually... This is getting close. Oh my... Just a few more checkpoints. We gotta keep up the pace. Oh, jeez. Wait, I can't rewind? No way! Wait, why can't I rewind? Oh my, I can, re I can rewind, but I can't rewind the time! Two seconds off. Oh my god, I gotta go really fast now. Well, I think I messed up. Because yeah, you can rewind, but you can't rewind. If you know what I'm saying. Wait, finish line. <gasps> no! No! Milliseconds! Oh my. Just give me one more second. Why won't the time rewind? That doesn't make sense. I rewind time, but I don't rewind time. That makes no sense. Now I gotta do this all over again. I just can't rewind apparently while doing these uh, outrun times. There's that turn that messed me up. This time I didn't rewind and I actually took the turn and I did it. Nice. Here we go. Alright. Next one. I think the next one's gonna be a race now. A race against the two cars I saw earlier. Let's find out. Win the race. Look at that. Yep. Exactly what I thought. Should I drive the other one? Yeah, I'll drive the other one. I'll do the other one. Why not? Let me drive them both. Nice choice. It'll never go out of style. All right, guys. We're about to see the Bugatti Veyron Barchetta in action, and you don't want to miss one bit of it. This Bugatti is a jewel that you'll see nowhere else. It's based on a Veyron Grand Sport Vitesse, but even more of a cool factor. Originally, they were gonna sell this car in very limited numbers to the rich and the famous, but it wasn't to be. So now there's only one in the world, and it lives one in the dreams. One in the Except world. For today. Make the most of it. All right. I'm gonna abuse this car. 
I'm gonna make this car go extinct. How's the car look? Car looks good. It looks like the same car as before, just a little bit different. How does first person look? Oh, it just looks like a Bugatti interior again. Hey now, hey now, hey now, stay back there. Oh, finish that already. Nice. The Bugatti Veyron Barchetta, a highlight of the day. You know, this car used to be the fastest production car in the world not that long ago. Wow. I'll probably take the black one over the one I just had. Next one. Outrun the clock. What's up, guys? It's time to move to the third and final part of our Dream Cars Tour. And we've got two great surprises coming straight What are those? Up. These are some of the most gorgeous and unconventional concept cars I have ever seen. There is no question about it. Are you ready? All right. We've got what We're I not? call the most beautiful car in the world, the Renault Trezor, and the super fierce Citroen GT. Mm. No matter which one you choose first, you're in for some serious fun. This is French Dreams. Let's go. I'm assuming this is going to be like the other ones. I am going to outrun the clock and then it's going to be a race against them. I'm going to choose this one first. The meanest French car ever made. You're going to like this one. Hour on the clock, but this time, gotta remember to not rewind, because it won't work. Car looks good. Looks futuristic, as always. First person check. Let's see how first person looks. Ooh. Looks different. I almost missed that. I have seconds left. Jeez, I gotta focus. I actually, like, can't mess up. If I do, it's over. Oh my power three, but I mean... Nice, that was close. But I made it. Alright, nice car. Nice car. I liked it. I liked it. Now I'm assuming it's a race against the two cars. Win the race. Yep, it's a race. Alright, I'm cheating the other one now. Renault Trezor it is. The beauty with the honeycomb hood. Alrighty, you're about to drive one of the most beautiful cars in the world, the Renault Trezor. More of a spaceship person, alright. I like it. This car has some of the coolest design features I've ever seen. Let me take you through some of them. Get this. It has a honeycomb-shaped air intake on the bottom. Interesting. It actually opens and closes. Tail lights that are made of special material that actually contract when braking. So cool. Never seen that before. Interesting. And a canopy that opens to reveal this bright red interior. All right, can't wait to see this in action. No pressure, driver. All right, you ready? Here comes the jewel. Good luck. All righty. I think I like this one more than the other one. It's electric, too. Sounds cool. Win the race. Oh, this, car, this car looks good. I like this one more. Outstanding Citra oh my, that was violent. That was violent. Just smacked me into poles. And of course, the electric sound sounds cool. Let's see if I get the cool sound to come up again. That sounds cool. The doo -doo 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 -doo. First person check. How does first person look? Whoa, now. Futuristic, as always. It looks cool as well. What is that? What's that pink thing? Look at that. I, when I accelerate, it just goes up. Okay, I'm getting too, too distracted. No way, this is all straights. I think I'm going to lose. This is just a straight. I'm losing. I'm losing. I can't catch up. I actually can't catch up. It's just straight, and electrics aren't good on top speed. They're not good on top speed, and I lost. Oh, I'm after this again. There we go. No, I didn't. Renault Trezor gets first position. Do not try and overtake that car, or she'll see red. All right, uh, let's go explore this next car. Reach top three. Welcome back, guys. 
All right, now it's time for you to race all of the cars in the playlist at the same time. Your car and the final car to be introduced into the dream Is this the last race? Is the Mercedes Vision EQ Silver Arrow. This is a beautiful, sleek, all-electric car with room just for you. It has this intense paintwork that gives off the feel of liquid metal. And when you step inside, it features a panoramic screen to help you navigate. A car that was made for this very race. So I'm not gonna say anymore. You just need to jump in behind the wheel and see for yourself. This is Supercar Festival. Let's do this. Is this the final race? Might be it. Oh, what the heck? I'm like on the right side this time. Slash left. I've never been on the left side before. This is weird. This thing looks sick. Looks like there's teeth coming out from the back. Oh my god, this thing feels good actually. It has one gear too. Does this have F1 tires? Looks like it has F1 tires as well. First person uh, looks pretty good. I like first person as well. Is this the future for F1 right here? Literally kind of looks like F1 and I missed a checkpoint. But um, it kind of looks like F1. Seems like it has F1 tires. It's low to the ground. It's one seat. It's, it looks like one. This reminds me of the race that took like 16 minutes. Reminds me of that race. I'm literally on the same road as last time. But this time it's not going to be as long. It's going to be more like 7 minutes long. It's still kind of long, but it's not as long as that other race. And there's the finish line. This was the Dream Cars experience organized by Motorfest. Damn, and I think that's it. I hope you guys had an awesome time. That felt short. I'm not gonna lie. This uh, reward card better be worth it. I li I spent one million dollars on this car right here. This better be the most futuristic car. I'll take it. It actually is futuristic. It's literally the car I drove. Almost done, guys. Don't worry. I'm almost done with the playlist. It's almost there. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys next time.